So you finally got all your maps, but you want to put them together. Not a problem. Select your mesh and click new. Drag in all your maps and make sure that anything that is not albedo or diffuse is set to non-color data. All right. Let's start with bump and normal because if you put them on later, it's really hard to see if they're working. If you're using bump, press shift A, S, type in bump and drag color into height and normal into normal. If you have a normal map, I recommend using that instead of bump. Drag color into normal and then press shift A, S, type in normal, drag it over the existing connection and click. Awesome, looks like it worked. If you have a diffuse map, drag color into base color. Otherwise, if you have an albedo and an AO, instead press shift A, S, mix RGB, drag albedo into color one and AO into color two. And drag color into base color. Drag specular color into specular. And if you have a gloss map, drag color into roughness, press shift A, S, type in invert, and drag it over the existing connection. Otherwise, if you have a rough map, just drag color into roughness. For displacement, click the wrench and click add modifier. Select subdivision surface, click simple, change viewpoint and render to six. Go to your renderer, change features set from supported to experimental. Then go to materials and under surface, change bump only to displacement and bump. Press shift A, S, type in displacement, enter, drag color into height, and displacement into displacement. Now, when this ugly mug shows his face, tell him to back off by setting scale down low. You're done. If you want smoother detail, you can go to the subdivision and make these numbers bigger, but be careful. Congratulations, you are now a master of principled plug and chug. Hope that helped. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to like and subscribe. Hope you have a fantastic day, and I'll see you around.